and we should be live with the first Neo stream on my stream ever. I've played like five minutes and I stopped playing because my other mode just just the joysticks messed up on it, so I haven't really played much at all. I'm quickly waiting for the stream to go live. Well, it is live, but it just hasn't updated on Twitch, and I want it to update bef before I actually start playing, so I'm going to be doing a new game. I want to see everything from the start, because I skipped all the cutscenes for my first five-minute playthrough. Okay, so actually, let's just refresh the dashboard page. Um, it's kind of being slow. Let's wait for it. <clears throat> Neo begins, okay. I think it should be good. It says it's offline. Okay, now it's updated. Okay. Let's go. New game. Uh, this will create a new character data for a new game. Yes. Hype. To the far east lies Zipangu. A land brimming with golden palaces and sparkling jewels. Kublai Khan, ruler of the Mongol Empire, sent a large army there, but the warriors of Zipangu used miraculous stones to put on a strong, strong defense. The Travels of Marco Polo, Chapter 6, 174-175 AD. Amrita. <clears throat> I'm guessing. Amrita. Yep. Ooh, Harry Potter. Harry Potter shit. The Queen of England remains locked in combat. With Spain. The country where the sun never sets. For control of the entire world. Her forces. Weakening with every battle, the queen and her inner circle turn to divination and alchemy, hiring pirates like us to find them written for them. With that power, I see. managed to defeat the invincible Spanish Armada. But now it seems they want to keep their methods a secret. Oh, hell no. <clears throat> Okay. The Tower of London is an imposing fortress built by King William I in order to keep London safe. It has since gone on to be used as a prison for traitors and execution grounds for criminals. Londoners believe that if the many crows living within the walls were to abandon it, the tower would collapse and London itself would be destroyed. Interesting. I don't think that's possible but sounds cool mm. me gusta That's our sexy British Geralt. Death comes for you. Oh, well, that's comforting. Seems death won't stop chasing me. Oh, nice crotch shot. April 1598, Tower of London, England. This way. Thanks for leading us. Oh, I'm punching rocks somehow. What does that give us? Okay, hold. So, just direction and X. Pretty much just like Dark Souls except X instead of O. Oh yeah, I remember this part. Here it's kind of weird because this guy has a sword. 
So you have to, like, fist fight him. And he has a sword, so... I don't know how to, like, do that finishing attack. Alright, we haven't lost any health. Oh! Just as I say that, man, I'm... I'm just wonderful at jinxing myself, huh? Okay, this guy's dead. Oh. I really screwed myself there, though. Alright, so we got the Bastard Sword. And we got the Dungeon Key. So I guess we can open our cell up. We can also open the cell next to us up. Nice, what does this have? It has... I don't know what that had. Guard. So, that one is guard and dodges. Okay. That's how you roll, I guess. You just press X to, like, dash in a certain direction. Okay. Nothing in that cell. Okay, I guess that's where you go next. But I know there's a room over there. So I'm gonna quickly check what's over there. But before we do that... Let me check my equipment. We got a Bastard Sword. Attack 70. Attack Multiplier 43. Change to Attack Heart. Oh, so that's a scaling. Okay, so they're scaling this game. Ooh, sweet. That's actually pretty exciting for some reason to me. Hmm. And we got a little chest. Tower of London Boots and another Bastard Sword. Interesting. Is there a way to, like, have... Hmm. I think this one's a little bit better. It reduces the amount of key I use for every hit, so... Uh, I think it has they have, they have the same uh, damage though. Right? 70, yeah. Same scaling, same all that. Okay. Ooh, what do we have here? Medicine. Okay, we do need some medicine. So let's equip that. Foot guards, yeah, we got the foot guards. And we also have the shortcuts. Okay. Nice. So we have some medicine now. So we can heal ourselves, and then, and then we have no more medicine. Okay, <laughs> that sucks for us, but okay. We also got ourselves a coat. I'm so used to playing the Dark Souls. I have to get used to the controls. Okay, torso armor, nice. Kind of looks hideous on me, but all right, it's all good. So you might as well just equip both bastard swords. I don't know how to flip them though. Hmm. I thought I had both equipped. That's weird. Okay, so. Yeah, that's the one I wanted to move. Okay. <clears throat> Got a little bridge for ourselves here. Oh shit, we got an archer. Okay. These guys, I mean these guys are the first areas, guys. They shouldn't be too difficult. Especially this guy. <laughs> The ranged guards I eat. The ranged guys are usually pretty weak in video games. Contrast the two, uh... Well, not weak. They're just really squishy. But they can be effective at range. Okay. I hate fighting in close quarters in most games. And now we can finish them off. Nice. I'm gonna go for my an axe playthrough. So hopefully I can find an axe sometime soon. Okay, 
I'm getting used to the dodging. Nice. I'm actually really liking the gameplay. Man, I'm getting I'm getting into this game. <laughs> I'm like five minutes in and I'm already kinda of feeling it. Nice. That's a good sign for a video game. It's a very good sign. I guess uh, let's get off here first. Okay, so that's where we have... So we already came from the bottom. And we have a shrine over here. And the shrine... Replenishes our health. And pretty much is like... It's pretty much like a bonfire. It's like sitting and leaving at a bonfire. And I know my battle axe is in there, so... Um... Quickly, actually, over here. Let's try to rune Ka. Has a little bit of a better attack. We also found some leg guards. So that'll be good for protecting ourselves. Protection is good. Is there three of them in there, or...? Okay, I guess maybe... Oh, okay, that's the pokey one. Okay, nice. I still don't know these weapons, so I'm probably looking like a fool using some of these. Gotta make sure my stamina. Oh, this guy's like trying to protect himself for his life. Oh. Okay, so the battle axe should be in here. I believe. Ooh. Yeah, screw you, Runka. We're using the battle axe. 112 damage. Hell yeah. And we didn't miss anything else. Shortcut for medicine and stone. Oh, I guess that's for like throwing stuff at people. Oh, okay. And we can't open this, we gotta go upstairs. Okay, gotcha. So, upstairs is the next place to go for shizzle. Upwards, let's go. Oh, I would have thought there was an enemy there. Guess not. I think there's some dialogue you can listen to here. Indeed, the pirates have served their purpose. The death of the leader of Japan will spark a war and a wonderful opportunity to acquire on this mischievous hassles. Once tomorrow's execution takes place. We will get our hands on a compass that will lead us to that Amrita. Not Jack Sparrow's Enough compass, I hope. Amrita, we could subdue Spain. Perhaps even the world. The day when England reigns supreme is near. But our beloved queen thinks of Amrita as nothing more than gold or gemstones. We must find them before our nation's rivals do. Edward Kelly, you will go to Japan. It's that it pale looking guy. It's Edward Kelly. The wars alive. We cannot gain Ambrita if blood does not flow. So I guess that's all the dialogue. Hey, who are you? <laughs> Shit. Nice. Battle axe, baby. We got we got everything in there. What about over here? Nice, we got a little chest. We got the hat as well. Let's check out the hat. Fashion souls. Cool. We were already down there, so the obvious next place to head is over here. Or is it? 
Yeah, actually, what is over here? Okay, the stairs. So I want to go over here first. Okay, it's just a little item. Gloves, okay. Let's get the gloves then. We got to be careful. Oh, the camera turns by itself in the stairs. Okay, that's good to know. So this is the next area. What? What? What's lower? Huh. I guess we go to that place first, though. Let's do it level by level. Ooh, that was close. Get some more medicine. Yeah, we're getting pretty stacked on the medicine. Okay, and this unlocks the shortcut, right? Yep. I believe the shrine is right there. Yeah, perfect. Got the shortcut now. And now we can head a level lower. Level design, baby. We got a coat. I guess this one's better. Let's try it out. Before I go outside, I want to see what's over here. Oh, there's three guys over here. Oh, I guess he was just like, <laughs> I'm screwed, it's whatever. So they have like trousers in here. And these are better as well. And these are better as well. Okay. No, it's this way. <laughs> it actually does damage, what? Aha! Feel the wrath of my little rocks. Oh, you bastard. How dare you. Ooh, bastard sword, medicine. You'll see the bastard sword, how good is it? 73. It's better than the other bastard swords. That's better strong attack break. I'm gonna stick with the battle axe though. That doesn't break? Okay. Hey, we're outside. Prison break, baby. My inner Dark Souls guys just wants to like break all these carts and whatnot. Oh, is this a better battle axe? It is a better battle axe. I think. I don't know. The base stats are better, so if the scaling's improved or decreased. It doesn't really matter, I suppose. Nice. Hmm. I don't see any archers or anything. I guess it's this guy. Come at me, bro. Well, that's kind of close, actually. Man, we got a crap, ton of crap load of medicine. Uh, okay, never mind. I think we'll uh, skip out on you for a second. Stones. 
Oh boy, we gotta be careful here. I mean, maybe we should go try to beat those knights first, because apparently they're gonna be common factor later on. Maybe we can lure one of these ones out by throwing a rock. Oh no. They're both coming. Oh man, these guys are... These guys mean business. Oh no. Intense fighting. Damn. Hurt my health. Or my medicine, I mean. I gotta wait for, like, both of them to hit. Woo. Gotta chill it out on the stamina. Damn. Yeah, I was about to get greedy there. This is so scary. Oh, he blocked that attack. Oh, gotcha. Come at me, bro. At least they don't heal, that's a good thing. Woo. Got him. Alright, let's check out all the new stuff we got here, huh? We got the Great Helm, which is evidently better. The gloves, or maybe the gloves are, might not be better. I think these are better, actually. And then the boots. They're definitely better. Um, hmm. I'm not sure that's actually better. Huh. I think I'm going to stick with this battle axe for now. What does this mean over here, actually? Ah, it's all the tutorials and stuff. Yeah, so what were they guarding over here? Oh, you can actually open this. Oh, sweet. <gasps> Yay. You got a prey thingy over here. I guess we should do it. Even though it's gonna respawn those guys over there. It's whatever. As long as there's like another way out of here, which I think there is. It could go down, for example. What the hell's down here? It's like a torture room or something. Okay, triangle when an when you're near an enemy. Okay. I thought we gonna fight someone here. Like, why would they give us that tip? Unless we're gonna fight someone. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. There's a lot to this area, isn't there? Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Ooh, 610. That's a lot. Another bastard sword. Another rune ka. I hope I don't miss out on anything. There's like these little chests laying around. They're kind of easy to miss, I guess. Just gonna be careful. There's so much to this place. I don't even know where I am. Well, I sort of know where I am, but... Oh, no, 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 not this way. No, 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 not, not here. Not yet, not yet. I'm pretty sure from what I've seen, like a couple of gameplays, that's like the final boss area. So I want to see if I can explore a little bit more. Because I know I haven't done everything. So I suppose let's go up another level. Maybe it's not the final boss? I don't know. Let's see what's in here. Bastard sword, medicine... Equipment, battle axe... Hmm... Oh, that has like a family. Oh, okay. So the more I use this, the better it'll get, I guess. I don't know. I feel like I'm just gonna keep on using this battle axe. Probably a stupid thing to do, but drop attack while in air press. I already killed that guy, though. I've already killed him. That's where, like, the boss fight, I guess, is. We've already gone down, I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, we did. So what's over here? Oh. Nothing, I guess. I want to see what's over in that other area. Oh shit. Oh shit, if we died. No, our first death. Oh boy, well. At least the loading screen. That's the good thing. The loading screens aren't like insane. So I mean, you don't feel too bad about dying. Plus, you have like a the prayer thing right next to it. So. Oh shit. I was close. Oh my god. No, I was so close to killing him. I really need to take off these pants. I mean, I have a belt on. That's why it's, it's so uncomfortable. Sitting down. All right, let me take that off. Ooh, sexy time, huh? Taking off the belt. On stream. Okay. Let's try this again. Oh man, nice. First attack completely missed. Oh god, what? Could have moved there. Was my stamina out? Why would my stamina be out? I only did two swings. Damn. If 
fight these guys again. I mean, I killed them last time because I was way more cautious. Maybe because I had more ground to to fight them on. Damn, I'm wasting all my medicine. Come on, man. I guess I won't do the heavy attack anymore. It takes too long to recover from. Ooh, okay. That was close. Come on, bro. Come at me. Oh shit. He came at me. I can see his stamina, I forgot about that. One of the things about this game is you can see people's stamina. Okay. Shit. I should probably maybe I can try doing more of like a Dark Souls style. Oh, fuck me. Oh my god, no. Really? I thought I... <sighs> Dodged there. Well. YOLO. I'm not wasting any more medicine. I want to see what's over here. Stupid though. Why did I do this? Ooh. And those guys didn't follow me, so maybe this was actually a good idea. Start using the dash more if I can. That's not an openable thing, I guess. When I went to GameStop to get Neo, one of the managers told me that they only received two copies of the game to release, unfortunately. Really? Only two copies? Sorry if I just only saw your comments. King Thunder. If only I could have gotten it earlier. Damn. That sucks. Wait, what? You can always get it on the PlayStation Store. Unless you're like super... Uh, I guess you really have to get it on physical copy. A lot of people want to like... Won't, won't buy games unless they get them on the physical copy because... You can't sell the digital back. You know. Come on, bro. Come on, come at me. Woo. Let's go. I had, to, I had to order it online. It should be here in two days, though. Okay. That's good. Have you been watching any streams? I've been watching a crap ton of Lobos. I've been watching Elijaz, or El Elias, whatever you want to pronounce his name like. Him and Lobos have been just binging them. <clears throat> I really like the personalities. No, I prefer physical copies because I like to collect and so that I can return if the game stops working. That makes sense. You know, no, 20 years, that might be worth a lot. Well, I couldn't really wait, so 
Oh shit, yeah, this these two of these at the same time is a little bit hard to manage. Fuck, 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 fuck. Heal. The stamina thing in this game is serious, man. Oh god, yeah. Almost dead. Oh no. I'm wasting all my medicine. Play killing these guys is gonna be worth it. Woo. Fuck. Okay, well. Boom. I haven't been watching too many streams. Also, my desire for physical copies is the reason why I track down physical copies of games like in f like Front Mission 3 instead of buying the digital version on PS3. Oh, that's an example of your physical copy addiction. I get it. I understand that. I guess my way of like preserving and hoarding games is recording them. I have a lot of physical copies as well, but I don't know. So that's really all that there was here. Okay. I guess we can progress over to the boss. That's all that there really, really is left here, isn't there? I'm pretty sure we've explored everything here, so... Uh, let's pray. Let's pray. Let's check out the equipment. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Okay, I want this battle axe instead. Got a better great helm. Uh, 38. That's probably the better one. 22. 26. 31. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm going like super newbie about this. I just look what looks best. My number. Have you found any pieces of armor on the box yet? Have you found any pieces of armor? Armor on the box yet. What? I'm not sure what you mean. Oh, the Baltarium Palace guys. Yeah, they do like look that. I was saying in some of the streams I was watching that this game looks and... F well, maybe not looks, but if from when you're watching the perspective, it feels a lot like... Uh, it looks like a lot like Demon Souls. Yeah, it's smashed. 13, 16 damage. Is it boss fight time over here? I think it is. Oh no. No, no, I'm scared. My first boss, Derek the Executioner. Oh man, that's ridiculously squishy. That, that, that was it? What? That was the boss? <laughs> what? That can't be the boss. Oh, I haven't. I, this is literally the first level, King Thunder. Literally the first. It's like the tutorial level. If I die, the secret of the stones dies with me. Let me show you what these stones can do. Behold. Oh god. Damn, what the hell was that? 
Oh yeah, he's gonna empower the Executioner guy. And now we're gonna have a real boss fight on our hands. Oh no. Oh no, I'm scared now. Mommy, I'm scared. Oh no. Sorry that you got muted. I'll, I'll mod you in a second. I usually mod people that... What happens to people? Oh shit. I mean, you gotta get used to the controls. It can be all wonky. Oh shit. It's the first boss. We can be newbie about it. Okay, so we gotta dodge, like, way out of his range, because when he charges, it's like a hit big hitbox. What did I just do? Why is there a thing flying around? Is it gonna actually help me? Ooh, well done. Quite a feat. I didn't even get to finish him though. took our waifu away. No. Oh, nice little constipation drone. <laughs> what did you say that got you muted? Oh, okay. Who is Devil Jin? Okay, jump off the tower. He looks like the devil from uh, Passion of the Christ, except more masculine. And yeah, he's also bold. Oh, death is an entry to life. Interesting. Squish the feather. Get angry at the feather. The feather is the cause of all your pain. I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of the Diablo-like loot, but everything about else about the game I like so far. A long journey begins. Trophy earned. <laughs> you got that right. Wait, what? That's weird, because I'm still streaming, I think, so... Should be okay. Oh, Tekken, okay. When you got infected by the devil gene, that's how he looks like. Gotcha. I played the Tekken on PSP, I remember. That was such a long time ago. That was like During ten years, years ago or something. Age, the hell off was lost. The trow sank. Why the hope vanished without a trace. The Damn. News of the blight about was nothing but oh, that's Spain, right? Only leaf that remained. No, wait, what? That was South America? What? I thought that was like the tip of Spain, like Gibraltar or something, but then I saw... That's not where Western Africa is placed like. An ironic twist. Or what awaited us in the Far East wasn't love. Okay, so he's going all the way around to Japan. Monsters and death. Neo. I love Souls games and loot-based games, so for me this is a match made in heaven. You're gonna be in heaven soon. Two days. Horns and huge wings. Okay. Good thing that I didn't have wings. I was scared enough already. Before I begin preparations for landfall, I leaf. Is that how they used to say leave? I leaf once more. Through that curious book I had changed upon. Recorded inside are the memoirs of a sailor who had once paid visit to the land of Zipangu. 
Precisely how this document wound up in the hold of this ship when its offer clearly belonged to the crew of a different boat is beyond me. But here I am, poring over its pages all the same, and not for the first time this voyage, I may add. What fascinated me above all else were the memoirs many accounts of Zipango's diverse armor and weaponry. Oh, I guess this is where I choose, huh? Choose your preferred weapon. What the hell is this? Sickle and a weighted chain. Spear. What do you think? I'm not a big fan of swords and dual swords. Spears and axe both look cool. I'm not sure about Kusarigama, but I think I'm gonna go with axe. That's the more most dark souls yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, he does look like Geralt. He's the British Geralt. Cheap man's British Geralt. I actually have Witcher 3. <clears throat> right over here, yeah. These are all the games I have, by the way. I have more, but I don't always have them on the game. Or here. I think I'm going to go with Axe. That's going to be my preferred weapon. Yeah, the Chain and Sickle did look cool, but it looks kind of difficult. So I, I can always try it out later, though. The sailor from the memoir seems to have spent quite some time in Zipangu and succeeded in keeping the company of Saperai. He writes in detail of establishments in Zipangu called Dojo, where people, including samurai, congregate for instruction in the martial disciplines. Just reading the sailor's vivid accounts, I feel as though I am there in the flesh, watching these warriors as they train. The samurai is master of many arm armaments and trains for combat in every single imaginable scenario. If I were to use another weapon, which one would I use? Oh, if I was going to use another one. Okay, so yeah, you always have that backup. That's what I always see people. Um, You could try this. I'm gonna go with spear. Or maybe I'm gonna go safe. I'm gonna go. You think so? Kusarigama. Let's do it. The memoir also asserts that the samurai are knowledgeable in the martial arts. First, they know which fighting stance to use in each situation, high, mid, or low. Second, after each attack, they ready themselves for their next strike by focusing their key or inner energy. Third, once their key is readied, the samurai can use purification techniques to rid their surroundings of malevolent events. I know not how, it, bleh. I know not how to explain it, but I feel as though I have some innate ability to grasp all these concepts, <laughs> and uh, have experimented many times with each technique. The memoir states Zipango is home to 8 million gods and other deities. Jesus. Exactly how this figure was derived, I can only imagine. But as I cast my, cast my gaze to the shore, I am struck by the sensation that some mystical power has been keeping watch over me. It is an energy that reminds me of the Sauris. Sauris. Or something. Sours. I pull out the memoir once more and survey each page until I arrive at the guardian spirit that best matches the force I am sensing. Okay. Kato. Taiba washi. Isonadai. Kato. I think I'm gonna go with. Since I'm a battle axe, I'm gonna go with Kato. Alright. So we get stamina, dexterity, and strength. That's, that seems pretty good. Close the memoir. Is this okay? Yes. Uh, yes. Probably. That'd be the best idea. Let's do the tutorial mission. Unless it's the same mission over. 
people it's not. The dojo is a training ground for samurai. It is filled with blood, sweat, and tears of the uncounted warriors who polished their techniques within its walls. These long traditions and secrets are handed down from generation to generation. Generation of samurai. Interesting. Dojo time, let's go. What's this? The quick attack is fast and doesn't consume much key, but only causes light damage. The strong attack is powerful, but consumes more key and lowers your guard. If your key reaches zero, you will not be able to attack until it recovers. Okay. Now what is this saying? R3 lock on, switch target of course. Yeah, I know this stuff. This stuff is simple. Yeah, we locked on. Oh, this place is beautiful. There we go. Okay, I think we're ready for the next. Well, maybe the game doesn't think we are. Oh shit. Am I doing something wrong? Am I supposed to like move on to another tutorial or I'm gonna look around. Maybe I missed something. Maybe I'm just supposed to fight a bunch of these? I guess I am. Oh man, that was bad. <laughs> You're spamming. If I remember correctly, I think there was a tip during loading screen in the demo saying that the mid stance is the best one to use for blocking. I think I'm using the mid stance now, right? Like on the bottom right, it looks like it's in the middle. There's one there's like your Weapon is, you know, sheathed away. There's the upper stance, and then there's the lower stance. So I think this is the one I'm using right now. Okay, what is with this tutorial? I've been fighting these guys for... Oh, it just wants me to do that. Okay. Maybe I just haven't been doing it, like the game wants me to do it. Come on, attack me. I feel like I'm doing it, but... Okay, maybe I should take a hit? Okay, that's what I had to do the whole time. Damn it. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm currently in mid-stance. Yep. I think you need to dodge right before you get hit to activate the next prompt. Yeah, I think it was just blocking. Or maybe it was just a little bit of both it wanted. Okay, switch stance. Okay, low stance. High stance emphasizes attack power. It allows for powerful techniques. Mid stance is good for defense. It has a wide range of techniques and is easy to use. Low stance is good for dodging. It doesn't consume much key. It also maintains your guard as you move. So... High stance. High stance is pretty cool. Whee! 
I love running like this. <laughs> okay, what's this one? Okay, so let's try low stance. So you just get to hit really fast. I think it's dodge really quickly. Woo! You saying bolt over here. And then we're back to uh Come on, hit me. Okay, I guess you don't wanna hit me. Proceeding to the next tutorial. Key pulse. R1 when bl while blue lights gather around you after an attack. Key pulse recovers your key. The amount varies based on your timing. The max amount is determined by your key gauge. Okay. This seems hard. Hey, what do I... Or R1, okay. Oh, and why am I keep pressing that button? Okay. Hey, I got it. Sort of. I'm not getting it great, but... Alright, cool. Yokai Realm and Purifications. Yokai Realm, another world born from the Yokai. When you are in the Yokai Realm, your key recovery speed is greatly reduced. Shit. Conversely, the powers of the Yokai themselves are enhanced there. That sucks. Purify recovers the max amount of key from accessible key pulse in the Yokai Realm. It also cleanses the defilement of the Yokai Realm from your person, restoring you to normal. That sounds. Um. I'm gonna try killing him one more time, if it lets me, so I can, uh... Okay, I don't think I did it right there. In this game, I have a hard time keeping my track of my health and stamina, since it always seems like every enemy does a lot more damage than tutorial enemies in the Souls games. So I turned it on the option for it to show numerical displays for my health and stamina. Oh, well, you can do that? I, I've seen, like, other people do that, but... I just didn't know how. But I guess you said you can do it, so I'm gonna quickly check. Base game settings, is it over here? Uh, I guess I have to look for off. Oh no, keep that on. Is it the key display? Ah, okay. Oh, that's great. Thank you. So yeah, that blue thing is like an active reload for your stamina. Okay, let's do it. Boom. Boom. Okay, so once again. Boom. 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 Okay. That's interesting. And this game is cool. Wooden axe. Okay. I wonder how this is going to look. Low stance of the axe. It's weird looking. But cool at the same time. I feel like everything in this game is cool. So want me to have it both equipped or... Yeah, I guess I want it both equipped. Oh shit. What's up dude? Change melee weapon, R1. Okay. Cool.
Oh wow, that's a lot of stuff. Shooting, okay. Shoot, press R2 while holding L2. Switch ammo type. Square for normal. Triangle for, pre for special. Press R3 to zoom. Ready your ranged weapon with L2. And press R2 to shoot. Use R to move the reticule. Switch between types of ammo by pressing square and triangle. Some enemies have a weak spot. Landing a hit on their weak spot will deal greater damage and break their stance. The middle of the reticule will turn red when pointed at the enemy's weak spot. And the rest of the reticle will turn red the closer you are to an enemy. Okay. How do I use it, though? Oh, sorry. I just ate a pizza. Burpee. I'll be right back. Alright. Thanks for coming by. Hopefully you'll see you soon. I need help. Okay, so... Hold L2. And R2. Okay. Okay, so I want this, for example. So where's the other guys? Oh, item shortcut. I guess we have some stuff in our shortcuts. Okay. We may proceed to the next tutorial. Living weapons. Living weapon. When the Guardian Spirit Amrita gauge is full, press circle plus triangle. Guardian Spirit skill. While a living weapon is active, press square plus triangle. Okay, so both. Or I mean a circle plus triangle. Triggering the living weapon changes the health gauge and key gauge into the living weapon gauge. As long as the living weapon gauge is active, you are impervious to damage and your close combat skills inflict more damage. The living weapon gauge increases over time and when the attack, an enemy attack lands... Oh. And when enemy attacks land. Okay. Once the gauge is fully depleted, the effects wear off. While living weapon is active, press circle plus triangle will, will perform your guardian spirit's unique skill. Okay, so you press it again after. Where's the Amrita gauge? Is it already active, I guess? All these missions tutorials have been completed. Oh, cool. So I guess we're done with the tutorial. This one, that, yes. All right, I think I am ready. All right, so. Yeah, I think this is stuff I want to use. Is this okay? Yes. The dinghies have been ready for us to make landfall. For all that... Wait, for all I have read on this country, nothing can truly prepare me for what now lies ahead. I put the memoir down and leave my cabin. Kuroshima is a tiny island at the coast of Usuki in Kyushu's Bungo province. There's a little... There is little in the way of usable land, with coastline rapidly giving way to cliffs and mountains. Clinging to its edge is the smallest of fishing villages, its residents, its res residents ecking out subsistence farming on plots carved out from the hills. Their frugal lives stand in stark contrast to the village elder, whose opulent mansion perches atop the island's tallest peak, strangely oversized for the small island which it overlooks. Okay. Okay, this is the level that everybody starts off on, I think. 
and we finally landed here. So I'll try to get for the first mission, and that's going to be it for the stream. It's going to be a shorter one. Maybe. It depends on how long this mission will take me. But I'm definitely going to play more tomorrow. I just want to kind of get it... Get past the first missions and tutorials. April, so two years later. So that voyage took two years. From the Tower of London. God damn. Black Steel Axe, thank you very much. What are they doing to us? They've taken everything. Is that a prayer? Is there anything over here? Maybe a shortcut in the future? Man, this game is beautiful. Like, the graphics aren't, like, the best when I'm looking at them right now, but... At the same time, it just feels so great and looks... So satisfying. I don't know why. It's weird. Alright, let's pray. Cool. Skill points obtained. Open the status menu via to learn new skills. Um, so I only have Kato right now. Level up. So I have one Amrita. So I can get some more health. Or I can get some more strength. I think I'm going to go with... Stamina first. Stamina seems like it's going to be an important thing in this game. Yes. What is make offering? Oh, I don't want to make an offering. No, thank you. Boons? What? Smithing texts. Sander, Crimson, Kabuto. What is all this stuff? Interesting. Sonnet. I'm playing offline, okay. I don't know why I'm playing offline. Um, Let's see what we got here. Ooh, cool. Oh, so this is like the... They give you some cool armor from the start. It looks a little bit silly, but... It looks cool too. What does a 99 stand for? Huh? Got some elixir, I guess. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, I want elixir up there. Stone. Small spirit stone. Okay. So the uh, elixir is like the heal, healing stuff. Do I have any range stuff? No, I don't think so. Not yet. We got the black steel axe at least, though. Items. An ancient text on forging armor. Describes the technique of making Japan's greatest armor set. Okay. Cool. Learn skills. Sword. No, not dual swords. No, axe. Yes. Huh. So we have two skill points. Mad Spinner 1. Play movie. Ooh. And yeah, this looks pretty good. But this looks pretty cool too. Hold triangle. I'm gonna learn this one. Cool. Skill customization. Hmm. All right, I'm back. Welcome back. Why? You don't have to be sorry, dude. It's cool. It's cool. I'm uh, trying to learn all this stuff. Apparently, I have nothing learned though. This is my status. I leveled up stamina, by the way. That was my first thing to level up. 
Title list. There's so much to this game, I don't know. Rita Memories? What? Okay, well, let's just play. So, this is our shrine. I got this armor from... Um, well, Mike. From the DLC, or the Boons, or something? So now I got like this sick armor. And they also gave me a, an axe. So let's get started, huh? Hopefully I don't get pooped on. It's every man for himself. Gotta be careful. Are there any enemies in here? I'm gonna do uh Let's do mid stance. Wait, what the hell? What the hell? I'm so confused. Why is my axe not working? Why does my axe want to come out? Oh, now it's okay. I just didn't have it equipped, I guess. Right, it's equipped. It's equipped now. I'm good. Oh, his arm got cut off. Ew. What does this guy have? Full soldier. Interesting. What is this? Oh, just a reader or something? I think there's like a. Ooh! A level 3 Revenant. Okay, let's fight it! Hey, practice makes perfect, right? Oh shit, I'm so. I'm so fucked. <laughs> no. I'm fucked. No! Damn it. Okay, well. <laughs> I'm so bad so far. Hey, practice shall make me perfect. I didn't want to use my medicine there, because I don't know if it replenishes or not. These guys are really easy to kill. Revenant is scary, though. Let me get our armorita back. Yeah, we're fighting it again. Holy shit, this guy is not good, but like, making me feel like shit. Woo! <laughs> it gets me so excited. <laughs> I actually killed something. I summon NPC, but still. Nice. Oh, don't worry, the healing items replenish. They do? Okay, so it's like Estus. I thought it was like collectibles from Demon Souls. I thought it was Demon Soul style. But if they replenish, this is good. This is good news. So this is very good news for me. Let me practice my key. Because I wasn't using my key pulse. Is this guy dead or... Oh, he's dead, okay. 
He has like the things on him. Woo. Let's go Axe, baby. Come on, come at me, bro. Can't be taking damage from these little guys. I don't know how long this level is. Oh, we got one of the shrine things. Oh, why are you so scared of me? How do I make it not scared of me? Hi, little guy. Oh, you have to walk up to it slowly. Okay. Oh, cutie. See you at home. Oh. This game is making me into like a kawaii. Wait, why is this just empty? I wasn't here before. Hmm. I'm gonna try low axe with that. The battle axe. I mean low stance, I mean. See if it's any good. Nice job hitting the... Nice. Is the brightness too low or too high? Screen brightness. Oh, I put on full brightness. Oh, rip. Oh, yeah, let me put it in the middle. Oh, yeah, this looks way better. Rip. I don't know, full brightness, I didn't even know. What is this? Oh, okay. Okay, let's put it like that. Yeah, this looks way better. In my opinion. That's where we came from. The brightness was still fine, don't worry about it. Okay. That's good to know. I guess let's have the spies, whatever the freak it was, there just in case. I feel like the armor we're wearing now is going to be good enough for a while. Hopefully. I don't even know what some of these things do. What they do? Let me check. I should probably check. Elixir. Restores health when used. Said to be made by Kodama. Tree spirits from nuts and seeds. But the truth is unknown. It only affects those with spiritual strength. Connoisseurs savor its unusual bitter flavor. Okay. I, I know what a rock is. I know this is for consuming Amrita. So I can consume that right now. Uh, water that has flowed through the intersect of a shrine. It speeds up key recovery for a short period. Okay, so it's like grass, pretty much. Or, you know, like the crescent. Not the crescent of grass. Not Demon Souls. Like the grass in the Dark Souls games. A charge of gunpowder wrapped in Japanese paper by ninja proficient in munitions. It explodes when thrown and damages. Okay, so this is like a little bomb. So that gave us a couple of souls or a couple of Marita. So now we get the bomb in this, in this one. Oh, he's level five. It's a little high level for me, I think. Green blossom, that's what it's called. Yeah, thanks. We came down from over here, right? Yeah. Okay, so what is this? A revenant. Okay, I'm so I'm actually really scared. No. Hey, man. Uh, skills. Woo! I'm totally. I'm. I'm good. 
it's totally not me spamming firebombs that I should probably save for like a boss or something. I'm gonna regret using those there, aren't I? Okay, I'm getting the basic hang of these uh, these guys. The simple dudes are pretty easy to kill. Watch me just get wrecked by them in a second. Okay, hey dude. Ah! Okay. Don't be that crazy, okay? Ooh. He's got a piece of purple gear of though. Go fuck him up. Wait, so did he drop the purple gear though? I didn't even actually didn't even notice. Crap. Um I don't think he dropped anything. Ooh. This looks okay, but whatever this DLC boons item is, I think it's still better. These are only weapons I have so far. Oh, what did I just do? Yeah, remove talisman. I don't know what I just did. Wait, what? What am I doing? Oh, that's the signpost talisman. Okay. Oh, okay. That's how you do it. Okay, press R1 and then up, down, left, right for those. Okay. Let me try... Uh... Oh, shit. I think I'm more comfortable with the battle axe. Oh, shit. It's kind of cool, though. This thing. Nice. Oh, my God. It slashes. Slashed his head off. Oh, the Revenant was that was level 5 has a piece of purple gear. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't think he dropped anything purple. Try it's, try out its low stance combo. Oh, shit. That's badass. Yeah, I gotta try it out. It's It seems a little risky, though, because you have to get like pretty close up and personal with that. And I don't think I'm feeling too safe for doing that yet. Not sure if I'm supposed to go this direction or. Hey, bro. Shit. Ooh. Some intense stuff. Aha. Oh, we got to actually get an extra elixir. And we got a weapon as well. Nice. What is this weapon? Oh, it's even in the, it's a better thing that we're using. Cool. We're still using slow decks. Low stance, I mean. Okay. What is over here, though? I think there's some items. Must turn your yeah, key poles. I gotta get I gotta get in the hang of using the key poles. Hey bro. Dude, it's so sick. I thank you for telling me that. Oh my god, this is epic. The low stance combo on this thing, it's so cool. And it's really effective against these simple dudes. Thank you for telling me to choose this thing. This is so cool. Okay, I gotta kill this guy first, though. Oh shit, what the... F Can you not shoot fire arrows at me? Oh fuck. Oh, 
Oh, I'm so screwed, aren't I? Ooh. Oh, we got an elixir. Good. Also, you can press triangle on a piece of gear in your inventory if you want to drop it. Okay. Gotcha. Thank you for the tips. Gotta say, I'm only like one hour into this game, but... I'm loving it. It just has that vibe, you know? Like, you know you're gonna like it. There's a Revenant I want to fight here, but I don't because of that fire arrow guy. I feel like it's going to be too much of a risk trying to fight him. Oh, I just jumped off the ledge. I hope I didn't screw anything up. Oh, there's a shortcut. There's the shortcut. How do I get over there? I guess I have, do I have to drop down? That doesn't make sense, though. I drop down. Oh, there's a ladder. Okay. Yay! Shortcut. Guess I can level up now. Okay. The ability to... The ability to receive Kodama Blessing has been unlocked. What does that mean? Hmm. I guess I'm gonna keep that. I still have Kato. So I'm not gonna change that, but I can level up now. I can level up twice. Should I level up my stamina twice? Wait. Stamina doesn't level up your stamina? Your key, I mean? <gasps> I thought it levels up your key! It doesn't. It's a w equipment weight and samurai skill points. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, damn, well. I guess we can level up heart twice. Or body. Yeah, let's get some health here. Make an offering. Oh, so that's how much Amrita will give you. 18. If I offer this weapon. I mean, why not? I mean, I got the other one, so... Hmm. Heart levels up key. Okay. I was just in my Dark Souls, you know, view, lifestyle. Okay. It's a good thing that we got the checkpoint though. I love his, like, Yoda sound effects. Oh, boy. Yokai. Chill, bro. Okay, so we came from, like, over there. So I guess we're going here now. I'm gonna go back to using the axe for a little bit. Try use the, using the high stance. Oh, shit. He's gonna stay down there. <laughs> Spare levels that up as well. 
Okay. I kind of want to go back and make sure... Oh. There you are. I want to make sure he was dead before I... Tried summoning up this revenant. Revenant. Let's see. Level 7. Oh, no. Mistakes have been made. Oh. Maybe not. <gasps> nice. Rogue armor, H Do, and Bizen Jimmy or whatever. I'm not gonna use that. Or maybe? No, I'm because I'm gonna be using those weapons mainly. I don't know. Hmm. I don't think it's better than my armor. This one's pretty close, though. I already got a shortcut. Unless you mean, like, there's another shortcut. Because I got this shortcut over here. And I just leveled up and stuff with it. That shortcut. There's, like, a ladder right there. So I think we're okay on that front. But if there's another one, I mean, I'm, I welcome it. I don't know how there'll be a shortcut to that, though. That's even better than another one. Okay, this is the guy. That was the pain in the dick. Okay, he's dead now. Which means I can fight the Revenant. I'm gonna go fight this guy first. Okay. If you're not gonna swing, I am. Oh, never mind then. Yeah. I got it. Okay. Um, oh. Okay, I see what I see what it's like. Now you freaking archers, you think you're the shit, huh? Well, news alert. You're not. Not there mic. There it is. Now I got a fighting chance. Who is he talking to? <gasps> YOLO. It's always a risk going down those cliffs. The bull possesses the child of the gods. The wandering soul goes where it must. Hmm. Kind of lost in this area. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's where we came from, though, so we don't want to keep going there. I guess this way? Yeah, there's the Revenant that I wanted to fight earlier. Okay, that's where I was. Where's the Revenant? There it is. Okay, now we can fight it. As well as kill this guy real quick. Black Steel Axe, Elixir. Not too shabby. Alright, let's kill this guy. Level 6. Karmic Punishment. Woo! Okay. I think I took a little damage from him there, but... I came out on top. Nice. I got a crap ton of stuff there. Let me quickly see if I got anything better. This looks exactly the same, actually. <laughs> actually, no, this one might be a little bit better. 
Maybe. Oh! Bandit axe. I think we found ourselves a new axe. Yes, yes we did. Hmm. Skill. Dexterity is the best one on that. Attack. Heart is the best on that. Yeah, I'm gonna keep... Keep it with that. Longbow, okay. Nothing better yet here. Cool, we got charms. I guess that's like uh, rings or something. Hmm. It's like the antidote for... Uh, Salt? I'm gonna have a lot of that throughout the rest of the game, huh? Yeah, alright. Let's grab this. I guess this is where we're heading off next. Alright, yeah. Oh, shrine! Hell yeah. Got another checkpoint. I still have absolutely no clue what obtaining glory is. Neither do I. <laughs> so, we're in the same boat there. Um, I'm not going to level up just yet because I want to check something. There's a crap ton of, crap ton of stuff I can... Uh, make offerings to. Which is cool because it's like a way of selling something. That you're not going to be using anymore. YOLO, bro. Huh. Yeah, this stuff is... I'm not going to sell too much, though, because I don't know what I could be missing out on. Can't change that, so... Okay, all I have is leveling up, but before I level up, I want to see what the bandit axe scales off of, and it seems... Okay, it's strength. Strength and the stamina. Or like, those are like the best things of her, I guess, is what it's saying. So I'll level up strength here twice. Because I haven't leveled it up at all since... Salt helps reduce the stamina of yokai enemies. Okay. Interesting. Do you like throw it at them or? Oh, sh okay, that's not good. Bro, that's what you get for surprising me. Please don't surprise me next time. Get some more arrows. Damn it all! I've only had a bow. From the shack. What are you talking about, bro? Hmm? I'm supposed to shoot something down? Shit. <laughs> I just wasted a bunch of arrows. I forgot, you're not supposed to press R2. Oh, you wanted to crap there, I saw. Hmm. I guess let's drop down over here. Get this item. We gotta make our way back. Way back to the shrine now. It's all good though, the shrine's like right here. I'm gonna use it while next to them. Okay. I'll try it out next time I get some yokai next to me. I think it's L2? Oh, just R2, okay. I'll press R2 next time. Damn it, I already forgot about that guy. 
Haha. -ha. Are we supposed to like fall down there or? I guess so. Small spirit stone. Close quarters are scary. Very, very scary stuff. Oh no. I'm scared. Should probably just oh, Woo. probably should have just done that, huh? Oh fuck! I got two of them coming at me. Wait, I got three of them now. Damn it! Why was there three of them? Where did they come from? Damn. Ripperonis. Uh, Neo prepared to die edition. <sighs> you know, I was really thirsty. Okay, you're not gonna trick me this time. Why Lay the dude. Okay. Got some arrows back. Can I quickly grab this? Or will someone notice me? Hopefully no one will notice me. He's not gonna like alert his friends, is he? If he dies here, it's just him, right? I think that's how it worked. So we gotta be stealthy. Oh shit. Ah, I didn't know he was a guy. He was just standing there, man. Okay, wow, his head just like flew in the air. Jesus. This armor's too heavy, I can barely move. Is that me talking? I don't think it is, because I'm English. Shit, he got me there. Damn it. they have in here. Do not allow yourself to be engulfed by the ominous key emanating from your yokai. 
Well, I feel like there's gonna be a big yokai baddie here. I knew it. Damn it. Oh shit. What? That one shot though. Less than pepperonis. Well, I'm dead. Damn it. Every single time, man. Well, almost every single time. This guy is super easy to kill. to back. Oh my god, no, I'm one shot again, aren't I? Oh, almost. These guys are hard. Okay, nice. Need to kill more of those bastards. Key to residence. Ooh. Is this the key to residence? Is that what that is? Nice. Perfect key pulse will resonate with the key around you and dispel the yokai realm. I see. Well, this guy's level 10. No, thank you. Not just yet. Let's guide this guy back home. Okay, well...
Alright, good stuff. We never pick up the stuff off this guy. So what's over here? Oh, a bunch of... Revenants. Some level 6 ones. Some level 6 ones. How did I miss there? There was a hidden one of those little guys that you missed early in the stage. Oh no. Well... What's what's in the past is in the past. Oh, I could have just gone up here the first time. But, I, but after I killed this guy, I was like, hey, I should just go around, huh? Well, I guess I got to explore a little bit more. Uh, let's fight this guy first. Oh, shit. It's really hard to dodge stuff on time for me. Alright. Ah, nice. We killed one of them. Taro the Brave. I'm really bad at this. <laughs> it's okay though. It's a learning experience. Experience. Okay, I'm probably gonna die here. So I'm gonna go. Oh, I can't go back actually. And spend my stuff. Well, it's only like one level, so. I think this is like a boss fight, maybe? Or it's just a key to the residence? Oh, okay, it's just a key to the residence. Well, I actually thought it was like a boss or something. Derp. No, no, it's not. Oh, there's another shrine. Sweet. What's happening on the foreign boat? I don't know, dude. You tell me. Alright, let's pray. Alright, so that we can level up once here, I think. Hmm. Gonna level up a little bit of heart. Okay. Make offerings. I'll do the offerings later. I have to like check out. Um. Oh yeah. Don't I have like? Let me see. Wait. It's not here. It's a. Uh... Learn skills. Okay, yeah, I have samurai skill points. Jeez. I haven't been spending them. Crap. Hmm. Oh, I guess I just bought it. Huh. I'm so confused on how this works. Okay. High stance only activates when you recover full Q from a Q pulse, raises the damage caused by your next attack. Ah, okay. But you can still find him if you want. It's not like he's dead now. Yeah, okay. I got you. Mid stance only. There's so much to this stuff. Hmm. 
I guess we can try to get some of this stuff. Probably just four guys named Rain on that boat. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, four Rain. Derp. <laughs> okay, that's that's just uh, that's it's good because it's bad. If you catch my drift. At this point, I don't even know what I'm upgrading, so I should probably just stop. Okay, so. Oh, okay, you can choose. Okay. So only I only have... Oh, this is for the other ones. So for this one, it's Rumbling Earth. Okay, or I can do Mad Spinner. Okay, now I understand this stuff. Okay, that's way more... I can understand now. Actually, you want Mad Spinner probably for these two. And then for High Stance, you want Rumbling Earth. Yeah, that would make way more sense, huh? Tangle Strike. Black Vines, what is... This? Okay. Hmm. Hold Square. Interesting. You can try it out. That was good. That was good, King Thunder. Good, but bad. In a good way. <laughs> Damn, it's so cool. Low stance, baby. I was trying to recover my key there. Not good enough it yet. Okay. Um, I feel more comfortable with the axe. Okay. Let's fight this guy. to go all the way around. Oh no, Yokai. Shit. Holy shit, this guy's doing like backflips and stuff. Tough. Woo, okay. I need to learn how to keep holes really bad. Really, really, really freaking bad. We're running out of stamina, I almost got me killed. And I'm sure it's gonna get me killed many times in the future. <laughs> Good, because that's what I was aiming for. Oh yeah, I know we gotta tip that bucket over. Calm down, Archer, dude. We're gonna fight this guy. Oh, 
Boom. Thank you very much. Said the goalkeeper. Actually, let me quickly check my uh, equipment. Maybe I have something better by now. Oh, maybe not. Bandit Axe is probably the best thing right now. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, I think so. Okay, this one's a little bit better, I guess. Okay, this one's probably the best one. According to this thing, anyway. Oh, so we found something better. Ooh, cool. I think, yeah, this one's better, too. Not just by number, but it has, like, more... Various defensive stats. I like how you read that in the Alex Jensen voice. What, what, what do I read in the Alex Jensen voice? What? <laughs> Who's Alex Jensen? I'm just secretly genius, I guess. Secretly comical genius dude. There's so many different items. Consumables. Okay, let's try everything out. Oh, opt-in to get two samurai points, whatever. Right now, all I'm concerning myself with is with the medicine, medicine stuff. Can you try saying, I never asked for this next time you die, just for laughs? That's the guy from Do Sex. Oh, okay. I never played that game, but I've I've seen gameplay. Never asked for this. Like that? Is that the voice you're talking about? <laughs> never asked. No, I can't do it. I don't know. You sounded like him when you read my message. Good. Because that's what I was aiming for. I don't know what I, I... I forgot how I said it. Damn it. I never try for these things. They just happen. It's like a bunch of Amrita I just ran into, or...? Mm. I love his little moans, like... <clears throat> Oh, okay, <laughs> nice. Nicely failed. I respect that. Okay, now I see the little bridge thing. Drop anything nice for us? No, you didn't, because you're a hater. I never asked for this. Dun, dun, dun. Oh shit! Ooh. Okay, I need to probably heal here. I mean, though I only have one thing to heal with. Oh shit, where am I now? Oh fuck. Let's go, boys. Let's do this. Let's kill a bunch of Japanese dudes. For some reason. We got pretty close. Well, at least I got pretty close, right? 
It's the thought that counts. The yokai are scary, man. Okay, nice. Got a couple hits on this guy. Oh shit. This guy means business. Damn it. Oh my god, no. Ugh. Ripperoni me. Do you know if this level is uh, any close to the boss where I, like, where I am? Because I want to kind of want to go to sleep early, but. At the same time, I kind of want to finish the first level. I should probably use... Let me try low stance. The battle axe. Feels too weird. That archer up there is really, really annoying. You're almost there? Okay. Good. Damn it. I let him hit me. At least I know not to fall down there anymore. But at the same time, I want to go get my... I want to get my... Shoal things. Hmm. What happens if I drop down here? Woo! Don't, but don't worry, you'll unlock a shortcut that'll make the run so much easier. Yeah, I, I know the shortcut, it's the water one, right? Drop down the water, drop the water down on the fire. I think that's what makes it easier. Revan and fight, baby. Okay, well, Yokai dude, can you not fight me while fight this guy? Fuck me, dude. I thought I pressed his heal. Damn it. What the hell's my stamina management? Jesus Christ, finally. up now oh, that's where the yokai was oh 
Oh my god, I'm dead. Yeah. Okay, actually, King Thunder, I know I'm close, but I really need to go to sleep, so... I'm definitely gonna continue a crap load of Neo tomorrow morning. Uh, but right now, I'm just gonna head off to sleep. Because I'm really tired. It's been a long day. Probably just can't focus right now. But thank you for coming by. All those tips you gave me. They definitely helped me out a crap ton. Wait, you can open this? Oh no. Has to be from the other side. Okay, well, anyway. Like I said, thanks for coming by. Really appreciate all the tips and everything you told me. And, uh... Crap load of this tomorrow. And in the weekend. And on the Sunday. And then on Monday. And then, not so for a while, but... Four days in a row. Anyway. Peace out, Thunder. Neo. Pretty good game so far. Definitely a pretty good game.